once you've tied your knot, you can pull it towards the back of your soundboard, keeping the string straight, not bending it up just yet um, to make sure that your string remains all nice. And you're going to put the end through the tuning peg at the top. Don't pull your string completely tight because you're going to need some slack before you start to tune. Leaving around four strings worth of slack, you can then bend the top of the string to hold it into place. Once you've measured how much excess string you need, hold the string so you don't lose how much. Take it away from the tuning peg. Grab some scissors away from your harp. Cut the end and you'll be left with a long string end that you can then put back in the packet and save for another day. Pop the string through the tuning peg and bend the end towards the neck to keep it into place. Have a look at your other strings to make sure that they're all in the same place. Don't tune with your lever on. Always put a string on and tune with your levers disengaged. On a new Pilgrim harp with brass levers, this means your levers should be down. Gradually start to turn the tuning key away from yourself, slowly allowing the string to wrap round the end of the string that will then anchor it into place. You want each twist to go closer and closer to the neck of your harp. And keep going, looping, slowly turning your tuning key, looping the string over and over and over. Do it nice and slowly because over tightened strings can snap the string. You, only sh you should only have three or four twists around your tuning peg. When you think you're nearly there, you can start to tune. Small movements to make sure you don't over tighten and snap your string. And there you have it. A string that matches all the others. It's nice and neat at the top. The short end's pointing towards the neck. For more information on how to tune the string, because you will need to tune a little bit over the next few days as your string settles, please visit our YouTube or our Frequently Asked Questions page on our website at www.pilgrimharps.co.uk for instructions on how to tune. Once you've finished, you can get your old string packet, gently loop the string around itself a bit, it in, keep it tightly sealed to keep it fresh and that will give you one maybe two sometimes three depending on the string more strings.